And now a quick update from Sapper Steel Forge. All right, guys. So we are finishing up, and this is the the smaller one, the one you saw me me do. I'm gonna add one more coat of wax to it, just to keep it nice and pretty. And to it, I'm gonna add this one. Now, you can see, once again, just that that white oak. So I've learned a lot about uh, white oak this week. Uh, you know, I knew it was a strong wood, obviously. Oak's known for its strength. But, uh, you know, it, it, it never really seemed to have a lot of character to me when I was using just the heart of it or, you know, using the lumber made from it. So uh, now I know the character is right there by the bark. I mean, that, that's where the, the really, really beautiful wood is. It, it has so much to offer as far as looks. It just, it really, really comes out. So that's the, like I said, we've got a set, a large one and a small one. They're, they're, they're hair popping sharp. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you needed to uh, harvest some stuff, you got your little garden, Get you some sickles. They'll work. I already took them out in there and uh, cut back some of the darn thorns around the doorway here, and they they work just fine for it. But uh, hey, if you uh, also needed to, for whatever reason, tackle a samurai a few hundred years ago, it's a dead trick too, or at least they would for some people. I suppose the uh, training was probably pretty important too. But uh, anyways, so that's it for the sickles. They they came out beautiful. We're gonna put them up in the uh, the uh, gun store and see uh, see if anybody likes them. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate all you guys, and y'all take care.